Well, there he is. How'd it go, Romeo? Oh, oh, hi, George. Hi, George. I leave you all alone in the apartment with a voluptuous girl, and all you have to say is hello, George? Oh, oh, I'm sorry. Um, that went okay, I guess, except for, uh... Except for what? Oh, I get it. She didn't... Oh, oh, no, no, it, it didn't even get that far. You see, what happened was... Listen, it, do you mind telling me everything tomorrow? I'm really tired right now, I want to go to bed. Uh, Good night. But... Oh, my God! There's a dead girl in my room. I see you met my date. <laughs> She's kind of cute, isn't she? Um, I didn't know where else to put her, George. I thought you said everything went well. Yeah, well, it did up until the point where she died. You know, George, if she hadn't have died, that would have been the best date of my whole life. Did you kill her? Well, not exactly. You see, <laughs> it's really funny. Let me tell you. Uh, uh, well, you see, we were sitting here on the couch, right? And we were watching Arsenio and, you know, kind of fooling around a little bit. And, uh, and she got a little thirsty. So I told her there was some uh, brews in the fridge and, you know, go help herself. And you know, George, how sometimes when we tuck things at the trash, we kind of miss a little bit? Well, I was eating a banana before, and I guess I just missed the trash just by a little bit. And when she went in there, boom! <laughs> I, I can't believe you're laughing at this. This isn't some kind of game, John. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I know, George. But if you could have just been there, I mean, you should have seen it. She went boom. <laughs> well, it was funny at the time, you know. You must be some kind of maniac. There's a dead girl in that room. Did you even bother calling the police? Police? Well, not exactly. You see. I was gonna wait and, and until you got back and see what you wanted to do, because you're good with these kind of things, Wait! You know? What are you waiting for? Waiting for this girl to turn into plasterboard? Are you waiting for next Tuesday's trash pickup? <laughs> I'm going for the police. Suit yourself. It wasn't finished anyway. I think it's okay. I can't see anybody. Oh, I thought for sure someone spotted us. They just had this weird feeling. Are you kidding? Not a chance. Look, we've had this plan for months. It was foolproof. Right. All right. Let's see what we got. I can't wait any longer. Oh, my God. There must be hundreds of thousands of dollars here. Oh, maybe even millions. <laughs> Susie, baby, I think <laughs> we're rich. <laughs> Who could that be? I don't know. Help me get this together. I'll go in the other room. If it's a cop, they'll know me for sure. Look, just keep them out of the storage room okay. and stay calm. Okay, okay. Who is it? And Inspector Bumble's with the police, ma'am. Uh, can you open the door, please? Thank you. Uh, I'm, I'm sorry to bother you this evening, ma'am, but... Uh, May I have a moment of your time? I'm over here, Inspector. Oh, damn. I hate when that happens. I'm Miss Take. Susie Take. Oh. Um, Thank why don't you have a seat, Inspector? Oh. Right See? this way. Right this way. Ah. <laughs> Excuse me for being so bold, Inspector, but how is it possible for you to be both a police inspector and be blind? Uh, doesn't that make things a bit difficult? Well, uh, yes, a mistake for the average person, that would be quite difficult. But you see, I've been blessed with the gift of extrasensory perception. Uh, you see, I'm, I'm a psychic. Psychic, huh? <laughs> yes, that's correct. Well, that's very interesting, Inspector. Um, what is it that I can do for you at this hour? Well, uh, as you may or may not be aware, a mistake, there was a robbery earlier this evening, and uh, uh, as I was walking past your door, uh, a vision came to me. I saw her, um, uh, bundles and bundles of money on a couch. Uh, do you mind if I have a look around here? I guess not. Huh. 
Yes, I, uh, I see a dirty, filthy, disgusting, smelly storage room. It's not that filthy. Huh, huh, huh. Do you mind if I, uh... No, sir. Go ahead. Huh. Aha! Just as I suspected. Another room. Hmm. Yes. Uh, but the clue is in here somewhere. I can, I can tell. Ha. Huh. 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 Yes, uh, of course. Uh. Hmm. Yes, uh, it's getting warmer. Um, uh, warmer? Oh, it's a peat duct. Oh, warmer, yes. Uh, well, uh, ha! Oh, we're in the other room again, aren't we? Uh, in the couch. Uh, oh, well. Uh, Miss Take, uh, do you mind if I ask you where you were, uh, this uh, morning between the hours of uh, one and two? Why, Inspector, huh. I was here sleeping, of course. Oh. Hmm. Tell us that one out. Uh, uh, well, one more question then before before I leave. Uh, have you seen any suspicious uh, or strange characters uh, hanging ar around these parts? Uh, only you, sir. Oh. Thanks. Well, uh, I guess I'll be on my way then. Uh, huh. Well, uh, you just. Uh, huh. It goes around here somewhere, isn't it? It's this way, sir. Oh, well, thank you. Well, you uh, just give us a call down the station house. Uh, go over there, aren't you? Uh, I'm right here, oh, Inspector. Oh, okay, there you are. I'm right here. Uh, if you see anything suspicious, just give us a little ring down the uh, oh, station house. Uh, I certainly will. Thank you. I feel so much better knowing that you're on this case. Uh, here, let, uh, there you go. Oh, well, thank you. Uh, we'll have a nice evening. You too. Good night, Inspector. Good night, ma'am. Oh, okay. Good night. I mean, does that beat everything? Oh, God. Who is it? Hey, Inspector Bumbles again, ma'am. Coming, Inspector! Oh, sorry, well. ah. Inspector, careful. Oh. I'm right here at this time. I'm right here. I'm right here. Ah. Well, I'm sorry to bother you again, ma'am, but uh, there is one thing I neglected to uh, mention to you. And what was that, Inspector? You're under arrest. And uh, you too, Mr. Kevin uh, Snake Eyes Johnson. <laughs> now, let's go. Vamos. Inspector, I don't understand. How, how could you have known it was us? Yeah, you can't even see, copper. Well, you see, my friends, I uh, possess a sight beyond mere colors and images. World truths cannot escape my mind's eye. A place where ultimate wisdom is boundless and justice always prevails. <laughs> what? Never mess with a psychic. Now let's get out down the hoose cow. Come on. I know where you are. All right. 